secondary occupation the occupation that produces useful commodities by processing the raw materials obtained from primary occupation is known as secondary occupation the materials obtained from primary occupation are more often not in desired shape nature and quality therefore it is necessary to process these materials into a final product according to our requirements secondary occupation includes all processing activities types of secondary occupation on the basis of size ownership and source of raw materials there are various types of secondary occupations on the basis of size and commodity there are three types of industries such as cottage industries small scale industry and large scale industry characteristics of tertiary occupation here are few characteristics of tertiary occupation tertiary occupation helps in the development of society due to tertiary occupation products are distributed to the consumers in time where there is demand thereby increasing the value of product tertiary occupations are found in urban areas number of people working in tertiary occupation is more in the developed regions distribution in maharashtra tertiary occupation is concentrated in cities of mumbai pune nagpur kolhapur aurangabad solapur in general tertiary occupations are found in developed areas and in high density zones quaternary occupation we have seen that human occupations are classified into three groups primary secondary and tertiary due to development of science and technology different types of services came into existence that is why there was a need to add one more group that is quaternary occupation these are special services created on the basis of intellectual activities these are special services created on the basis of intellectual occupation importance of these services is increasing day by day number of people who are earning their living in these activities is increasing in these services imagination and thinking process is involved services of quaternary occupations are increasing to make human life more easy and comfortable in these activities research science and technology information technology medical science technological field administration and biotechnology are included characteristics of quaternary occupations here are a few characteristics of quaternary occupations these occupations are based on an individual's knowledge and skill they are necessary for the increase in production in these occupations capital investment is more quaternary occupations help in availability and speeding of secondary and tertiary occupation income of people engaged in these occupations is more than other occupations distribution of quaternary occupations quaternary activities are extremely unevenly distributed only selected cities have concentration of these activities the way ahead maharashtra has maximum contribution in it sector of india in our state high quality manpower education institutes with high standard 
and infrastructure facilities are available. Pune, which is an education center, is known as an information technology hub. Today, this city is known as a main center for information technology. In information technology, microelectronic system, broadcasting, television, auto electronics, etc. are included. The high technology is used in genetic engineering energy and sector, health, pharmaceutical and transportation field. Availability of job opportunities is increased due to IT complexes. Computers have become cheaper. Information about global markets has become available to everybody.